In today's video I am going to show you an amazing page loader animation by using HTML and CSS. You can support me on Patreon and get the source code for all the tutorials. A page loader is a web page component that provides a notification to the user while the server is undergoing processing. It is very helpful when a page took some seconds to load the web page content or waiting for the HTTP response from the server. From this tutorial you can learn 2D and 3D transformation of elements, loading animation using keyframes rule, and glow animation effect using box shadow. Now let's get started the coding part. Create div elements to design ring shapes and set the background color, width and height properties to the body element. Also set height and width of the div elements along with the position property. By adding a border as 13 pixels and border radius as 50%, the div is converted as a circle. Removes all default margins and padding for every object on the page by setting the value 0. If you set box sizing, border box, on an element, padding and border are included in the width and height. By using display flex, all child elements automatically align like columns with auto width and height. The justify content and align item properties align the elements to the center in both vertically and horizontally. The CSS transform property with rotate Y function is used to rotate elements around the Y axis in a three dimensional. The Rotatex CSS function defines a transformation that rotates an element around the x-axis. Copy the transformation property of second div and place exactly opposite to it by setting negative value of the rotate y function. Create a ball object by adding height, width, border radius and position properties to the before selector of the div elements. Call an animation by using an animation property with animation duration and animation iteration count is infinite. You can make CSS more dynamic by declaring global variables inside the root selector and assign the global variables by using var function. The keyframes rule specifies the animation by gradually changing from one style to another. Now rotate the ring element by changing the values of rotate z function. Set the values of rotate z function for remining div elements. Add animation to the ball object to rotate in its z axis to match with its ring. Create global variables for the color properties to the ring and ball objects, and set the border color for all div elements. Let's add glowing animation effects to the ball elements by adding background color and box shadow properties. Now a beautiful page loader is ready to use. This you can animate on the overlay element on the top of the web page when click on a link or button. Thanks for watching this tutorial. Please share your feedback that encourages and motivates us to create more creative tutorials.